crazy roller coaster. Um, but you know, we came back to the relationship much stronger because we had a chance to just work on ourselves individually without each other being like, you know what I mean, on top of each other. So um, we came back to the relationship just much stronger. Like, um, you know, honestly, filming with Jackie is always very entertaining. You know, it's just, it's very, you don't know, ever know what to expect. I've known Jackie for a while, so, um, you know, we have just, we just have this relationship where we can be that blunt with one another. You know, we know when we're, we're serious and so on and so forth. So, um, you know, it's, it's actually fun. Filming with Jackie is actually, you know, like, it's pretty fun. It's, you know, it's a hilarious because it's entertaining. You're like, is she going to cry? Is she going to laugh? Like now, um, she has about four different personalities that I've seen, and initially her first one is always the best one. Um, so she gives you that at first, so you're drawn to her, and then all the other two, three, four follow, and then you start to be like, ah, I knew you would get the hell out of here. My relationship with Drea is fine. I just, it's, you know, there's a lot of things that I notice about Drea and her being herself and um, who she portrays. You know, I go with it. Like, if that's what you want to do, then you. Like, can we expect some wedding in the contract? Yeah, but you know what? Yeah, but I think we're gonna keep that private. Um, I give enough of myself that I don't want to give everybody that you know, the money. If I decide, maybe down the line, then that's what we'll do. But we're already married. I don't really. I've been with that man 12 years, right? <laughs> um, we, you know, we lost him on the show, Walter. Um, he's amazing. Um, and then we, you know, we gained from Bailey, we uh, gained another Kelsey from Sandy. And you know, it's always interesting when you throw new girls into a crew. You know, we are we are already a very dysfunctional family. You know, we kind of like gained two new step kids. So it's very, at first you're like, you know, you're really apprehensive. You don't really be like, okay, we already got too much drama. Like, what, what are y'all doing, you know? Um, so it's, it's, it was very interesting. But now, as the show has developed, like, you kind of start to see where the friendships are going. So it's been fun. You know what? We shouldn't be called uh, Ask Girl Lives LA. It should be called, like, the group or the crew. Because we got hella different people. We, like, light a shade of gray. We got, it just varies. But um, it's pretty well. I mean, Bambi is great. Um, she's Malaysia's friend. And Brooke is absolutely amazing. Um, Brooke keeps her real the whole time. She's great. No, so, I don't, uh, I'm not one to really, like, kind of kick someone while they're down. I know she's going through a lot. You know, I think my advice to Evelyn would just be, you know, just to do what she feels is right and not kind of, you know, do things that she feels to please other people or the audience or what she should be doing, you know? Matt and I have gone through so much stuff, including a domestic violence situation, so I understand completely where she's going through. Um, and I know she had a lot of negatives to say, you know, things to say about Matt and I when we have gone through our stuff, but, you know, I'm just not one. Like, I'm just kind of like, you know, I just, I, I try to stay out of it. I try to. Taekwondo in like three weeks. It was it was absolutely bananas. But um, I had an amazing time. So I'm looking forward to kind of pursuing more of those projects. And then um, you know we have a fitness DVD coming out next year. And I have another show called Backstage Confidential. I'm hosting and interviewing different comedians and red carpet events. So I got a lot of stuff going on. It's gonna be next year's gonna be really exciting.